we have new details about a fatal shooting we brought you last night at 11. A Youngstown police say one man was killed outside a Southside bar. 27 First News This Morning reporter Nathan Lahoda is live outside the Southern Tavern Bar with the latest information. Nate? Dana Lauren, I'm here outside the Southern Tavern on Glenwood Avenue where police say one man is dead and five are injured in an exchange of gunfire. Now, as you can see here, there were multiple shots fired from the gunman. And in fact, there are some of the shots made it close to the door and injured a few people inside of the bar. Now, witnesses told police someone ran up to a group here on the sidewalk and shot one, and one of the members shot back at the gunman. Now, bar patrons told me when they left out the front door, they saw one man lying on the pavement. The shooting happened around 1030 last night and left neighbors emotional and asking a lot of questions. Youngstown Police Department says those answers are on the way. We believe that uh, this will be solved. We, we have a good idea of the parties involved and, and confident that this will be resolved fairly quickly. Now coming up in the, excuse me, the names of those involved, including six victims and any suspects involved, have not been released. And coming up the next hour, we'll hear from investigators who say this crime may be related to another recent crime. But for now, I'm going to send it to James Santilli live in the studio, who has a little bit more background information about other incidents involving this bar. James? Yeah, thank you very much, Nate. Very good information in that report. And this is not the first time we have seen violence at the Southern Tavern. Last night, we could hear a man yelling at police to close the bar down. And I would like to play it for you, but frankly, the man swears through almost all of it. Back to the task at hand. In September, police arrested the owner of the Southern Tavern on claims that he waved a gun in a customer's face. There was another incident last year. Police say a man assaulted his girlfriend inside the bar and then crashed his car at Midlothian in Glenwood. He was charged with assault and drunk driving. Going back a little further, December of 2000, the managers ejected two men from the Southern Tavern. Then police say one of them, a man named Billy O. McGeorge, shot the other man twice in the parking lot. Police charged him with attempted murder. First News is going to reach out to the bar owner later today for comment. I did look at Ohio's Division of Liquor Control website to see their history of the Southern Tavern. And really, just a couple minor tax cases pop up. Important to note there, the Department of Public Safety has never issued any violation for the Southern Tavern. Live in the studio, James Santelli, First News This Morning.